Hi everyone. Are you worried about your job potentially disappearing? Worried that your career or job is going to be a victim to layoffs? This list will provide the jobs that are on the decline in the US. So if you're looking for a job out there, you might want to avoid these jobs as there are going to be fewer of them in the future. Thanks for coming to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. I talk about jobs, careers, education, and other related material. My aim is to help you make choices on your own careers with the best information you can get. You're not alone out there, and there are many people just like you trying to do the same thing. To see more videos like this, please consider subscribing and liking the video. So let's get into the list. The top five fastest declining jobs in the US. When I was younger, I remember going to a shop in the mall that sold watches, and the person behind the counter was pretty skilled at repairing watches of all kinds. When I went to these stores, it was just replacing the battery in my watch at the time. But this looked to be a fairly skilled job from what I saw. Watch repairers seem to be a job occupation that's slowly dying off. As more and more watches become electronic in forms like the Apple Watch or the Fitbit, fewer watch repair people are needed to replace the batteries or fix the gears of the watch. As this won't disappear entirely due to the fact that some people just like to have a watch with a second hand and a minute hand, it's definitely not going to be a job that sees growth. This occupation looks to decline in numbers by almost 30% over the next 10 years. Word processors and typists are roles not seen very often. Their sole duties are to type letters, reports, forms, and other related materials. With advances in technology, in terms of office software and computer technology, this occupation has seen a steady decline. With the typewriter long gone from the workplace, the duties once performed by a typist are now performed by office managers, administration assistants, and other staff as additional duties. Also, with software programs like Microsoft Word, this cuts down on the time needed to get the document completed. Though some jobs still remain, this role is going to continue to decline by over a third in the next 10 years. Parking enforcement workers are individuals that work in parking lots or garages, or in police departments monitoring parking lots in the streets. With parking lots and garages, these workers make sure that the individuals who have parked there have paid for the parking. With the parking enforcement officers and police departments, they monitor the streets to make sure that cars are not parked where they shouldn't be. This occupation is going to shrink by almost 37% over the next 10 years. This is partially due to automation. As more parking lots move to automated parking, fewer people are required to work and attend to these lots. And if police departments need to cut their budgets, this role will be the first gone and the duties given to the police officers. Respiratory therapy technicians work in the medical industry in hospitals or in various medical centers. Their role assists the respiratory therapists in helping with the patient's breathing conditions. This role is one where they perform the tasks and treating breathing treatment plans, but they're done under supervision. This role is one that is in demand, but the reason why this specific occupation is declining is that physician assistants are assuming many of the duties this position typically performs. Also, there are a lot of baby boomers retiring, so there are now more retirements than new roles filled for this job. As PAs make more money on average, more individuals are moving toward the PA role than a respiratory therapy technician. Due to these circumstances, this occupation is expected to decrease over 57% in the next 10 years. You might not have heard this position before, but locomotive fires are assistant jobs that act as lookouts for the train. They keep an eye out for debris or obstacles around a train and tracks. This job also monitors the train instruments. This job is looking to decline by over 68% over the next 10 years. The reason for this, automation and streamlining of train operations. Many of the items that this person does can easily be handled by the engineers on the train. And as technology improves, fewer people are needed to make sure the train operates correctly. So if you're in this job or looking for jobs in this field, be warned, it's not a career that is expanding. It's estimated that only a couple hundred jobs will be left at the end of the next 10 years. There's our top five jobs that are shrinking fast. Several of these roles are subject to loss through automation and technology improvements. Let me know in the comments section if you have experience in these positions and what your experience has been. To avoid these jobs, and find some rapidly expanding occupations, check out my other video for the top five fastest growing jobs. If you like this top five list or wanna see more, please let me know in the comments. Also, if there's something that you'd like to see in a future video, let me know in the comments as well. If you like this video, please consider clicking the thumbs up. And if you wanna see more content that I provide, please also consider subscribing. Again, thank you for watching the video. I hope you have a wonderful day. Be safe. Have a good one. Bye.